Welcome to Wessex Garages in Newport. Today we have for you a Kia Sportage 3 Satnav. This vehicle is in white and it's a diesel manual. I'm going to be giving you a tour of this vehicle today, but for more information or further specifications on this vehicle, don't hesitate to go online at www.wessexgarages.com and type the number plate into the search bar. We're going to start with the 360 on the outside of the vehicle. It's a nice swept headlights on the front with fog lamps down at the bottom. As we come around the corner, you'll be able to see the 18 inch alloy wheels, body coloured door mirrors, and chrome door handles. This the vehicle also has side steps fitted, privacy glass for the rear of the vehicle, your fuel economy for this vehicle will be at 52.3 miles to the gallon on a combined cycle. At the back then you have heated rear windscreen and parking sensors on the back bumper as well. So we're going to go inside now starting with the boot. As I lift the boot lid up you'll notice this vehicle is equipped with a reverse parking camera which I'll demonstrate later on. Decent sized boot space there with a 60-40 rear seat split in the eventuality you need to pop seats down to accommodate some extra luggage. Courtesy interior light to the left hand side as well as a 12 volt power outlet and a full size spare underneath. You then have a boot cover to hide all your possessions whilst you're out and about. Moving into the rear of the vehicle then. <coughs> You have electric windows for the rear of the vehicle, including heated rear seats, speakers and storage down below. It's a full black leather interior running right the way through the vehicle with three seats in the rear, fitted with three-point seat belts, headrests and all equipped with ISOFIX. When the centre seat's not being occupied, you can pop it down to accommodate an armrest and some cup holders. Plenty of leg room in the back as well, with additional storage in the rear of the front seats. Moving into the front of the vehicle then, you have electric windows for all around the vehicle, including electric door locking and window locking. When you have smaller children on board, electric mirror adjustments as well as electric folding mirrors. Speakers up at the top and the bottom and storage down below as well. Same black leather interior running right the way into the front of the vehicle as well, with height adjustable driver's seat. Moving into the vehicle, to the right hand side of the steering wheel, you have various options such as your hill start assist to help you out with those trickier inclines and your auto stop start technology which allows the engine to switch off whilst idle for example at lights and then re-engages once the clutch is depressed moving around then onto the centre console you have your CDM radio display this vehicle is also equipped with Bluetooth technology to allow you to make your phone calls safely whilst you're on the move. Additionally, you may wish to stream your media from Bluetooth compatible devices straight to the vehicle without the need for any wires. Moving down then, as I said before, you, this vehicle is, has a reverse parking camera which appears by here with a grid warning system on the floor to alert you to how close to objects you're getting. This vehicle then has satellite navigation via the use of the map and nav button which you can then navigate freely using the touch screen capability. Moving down then you have your air climate controls and a bit furthermore you have a 12 volt power outlet, an auxiliary input and a USB input for all your various gadgets you decide to bring with you on your journeys. Heated seats for both front seats and as I said before this is a manual vehicle and has six forward gears. Cup holders in the middle with additional storage in the centre armrest. Up above then both in the rear and the front you have sun shades that come back to reveal the typical British weather. And if you pop the roof back once more just like so and use the alternative button to close just like that. On the steering wheel then you have various volume controls and skip track controls on the left hand side. Moving down to you Bluetooth connectivity and voice activation at the bottom and on the right hand side everything to do with your cruise control. Last but not least then on the main dash itself you have your revs and temperature to the left hand side, fuel and miles per hour to the right hand side and if I zoom in you'll be able to see this vehicle has currently done 11,179 miles. Well thank you for watching this video today, a quick reminder this vehicle will come with a remainder of the 7 year Kia warranty. For more information don't hesitate to go online at www.wessexgarages.com and type the number plate into the search bar. This is additionally where you'll be able to book yourself a test drive of this vehicle. But for all other inquiries don't hesitate to come down into our showroom or phone one of our friendly salesmen who will be glad to help you out with any inquiries you have on this vehicle. Thank you for watching this video from Wessex Garages in Newport. Thank you for viewing our short video and we hope you found it informative. If you would like more information or any specific areas you would like to look at in more detail, please click the link so we can send you a personalised extended video to your specific requirements. This may take a few hours so please bear with us. At Wessex Garages we pride ourselves on our three pillars. Total trust, transparency and value for money. This alongside our guarantee to beat any bank or building society finance quote 
means you can purchase with confidence. Complemented by our high levels of customer service is why 9 out of 10 of our customers recommend us on Revu.